Hello, Times Crossword, let's go. And I have an announcement that I will make straight after the solve. British brothers who sang about high-rise suburb. Boring name, boring, idle. Move, move stealthily around rogue US spy base. Wow, tricky one today. Thousand Island, first class. I wonder if this is Mai Tai. So thousand is M, the abbreviation for meal. Island is A-I-T. First class is A-1 and a Mai Tai is a cocktail. Secured, folio placed in prepared prepaid envelope. Okay, so I'm confident it ends safe because a prepaid envelope is an SAE, stamped addressed envelope, and folio, the abbreviation for that is F, so F placed in SAE is safe. Secured. Okay, I'm feeling slightly doubtful now because I've accounted for safe, but not the first four letters. Folio placed, ah, it must be prepared. Prepared is made and made safe is secured. Bank on introduction of Ezra Pound verse. Bank could be rely, so it looks like verse is the definition, not getting it. Driver found stuck in middle of dam. Florida shed housing black echo of the past. Food business needs elastic supply. And supply could be supply, in which case it could be an anagram indicator. And there are 12 letters in elastic needs. So is there an anagram of needs elastic, which means food business? Yes, I think there is delicatessen. Yep, that accounts for all the letters. Is it needs? Yep, yeah, needs are the last three and first two and in the middle we do have elastic fantastic mineral deposit right in missile launch area no nope. one year following winless season american kids fails to finish course in japan okay well the definition looks like course in japan which suggests to me a food item, perhaps yakitori. I'm not au fait with a lot of Japanese food, but yakitori is a Japanese word. Does the word play work? One year following winless season. Ah, winless season could be... I think this is teriyaki. Yeah. So the season is winter. Winless winter is T-E-R. One year is one and Y the abbreviation. American is A, the abbreviation. And kid fails to finish is kid without its final D. And teriyaki is Japanese food. A particular type. Giant animal, iguanodon, I think. Droppings, guano. Make, do, nitrogen, N, below one, I. I'm just wondering whether the definition is giant or giant animal. But I think it's giant animal. Hindu, returning... A Hong Kong carpet. Wow, what is that? 
Barring outsiders, try second event. Get to assemble again. This is reconvene. So if you remove the outsider, the outside letters of the following words, you get R from try, econ from second, then from event, and E from get. Put them together and you get reconvene, which means to assemble again. Madam features in film. The, the Cornwall tourist is Emmett. So Madam is M-M-E, the abbreviation. Features in film, E.T. was a film, and a Cornish expression for a tourist is an Emmet. Cornwall being a county in England. Intolerable, not on. Midday is noon, temperature is tea, inside, inside noon. Fantastic. Speeding up a bit after the very slow start. Clergyman. Not very upper class, succeeded as a high flyer. Icarus was a high flyer who burned his wings in Greek mythology, flying close to the sun. So clergyman is vicar, not very, without the, the abbreviation for very. Upper class is you, and succeeded is s, the abbreviation. Talented Frenchman, designing a deluxe mansard. I think a mansard is a type of roof. But how does this work? Wow, I need more letters in this. Penelope's husband, liberally used soy sauce at first. So I think liberally is an anagram indicator for used soy and S, which is sauce at first. And I think this is Odysseus, another reference to Greek or Roman mythology. Do the letters, does the anagram work? U, S, E, D, Soy and S, it does, fantastic. State vote, breaking the laws regularly. Wow, yeah, this is Texas. So Texas is a state. Vote is X because you put an X on your ballot paper when you're voting. Breaking or in the middle of the laws regularly. Regularly indicates every other letter. So T, E, A and S. Talented Frenchman. Well, X is a good letter to see. That helps to restrict the possibilities. Ah, Alexander Dumas. French, a French author. I'm just wondering what books he wrote. Maybe The Three Musketeers. So he would be a talented Frenchman. Designing. Oh, well, designing is just an anagram indicator for a deluxe mansard. Nothing to do with a roof. Let me just check the number of letters. Seven in a deluxe, seven in mansard, 14 in total. Just looking by eye. I wouldn't want this to be Alexandra. So, A, D, E, L, U, X, E, Mansard. Let me just check the number of A's. There should be three A's and two E's. Three A's, two E's. Okay, I'm happy with this. Musician. Franz at last. This is Liszt. Liszt is a composer. Franz at last is the last letter of Franz. Z. Cuts record, cuts list. Nine minutes down. Shakes round top, not being this. Wow, don't know. Indiana bangs. Yeah, this is in fringe. So, Indiana is a state in America and its abbreviation is I-N. Bangs is a reference to an, a hairstyle and in particular the fringe where the hair is just hanging down above the eyes and to infringe is to violate the law. 
provocative glimpse of the pub by the sound of it. Pub could be in. Not getting it. No new letters in 13 down. Hector sent back to carry a plant. No. Knocking back castle. Carry. Ale really restricts legs of runners. Wow, that is a difficult clue to even begin to pass. Having run out of nail polish, ordered Germanic cosmetic. Wow. Rhythmic jazz lead accepts honour in retirement. Wow. Okay, well, having had a slow start and sped up, I'm back to slowing down again. Bank on introduction of Ezra. Ezra is, you, is usually in crosswords EZ, the abbreviation. Pound. Verse. No, not getting that. Just wondering if it could be Dow Zeeper. But I'm just not getting how any of it works apart from, and that doesn't even work for Ezra, so that's not right. Florida. That's likely to be either a reference to an American term or its abbreviation, which I think is FL. Shed. Ah, this is flashback view. So, Florida is FL. Shed is shack. Florida is FLA. Shed is shack, housing black. B is the abbreviation for black, and a flashback is an echo of the past. Now, an orphan clue. Hindu returning a... Hong Kong, HK, the abbreviation for Hong Kong. Carpet, yeah, this is Gurkha, which is a type of Hindu, and returning or reversed a Hong Kong carpet, a HK rug. Mineral deposit, right, yeah, this is ochre. So, ochre is a mineral deposit, right is R, and the, miss the missile launch area is the Oki, which is the line behind which you stand when you're playing darts, a game using missiles. Driver found stuck in middle of dam. Wow. Middle of dam is A. But something can't be in the middle of a single letter. So it's likely to be in the middle of a synonym for dam. Wow, just not getting that. Is A a new letter for A to cross? Having run out of nail polish, ordered Germanic. Cosmetic. So I think the definition is cosmetic. Ordered could indicate an anagram of Germanic, in which case this could end cream. And we've still got NG. So Germanic is all of these letters, ing, cream. I want to put vanishing cream. So having run out of nail polish, varnish is nail polish. Run is R, the cricketing abbreviation. So R out of varnish is vanish. And then an anagram of Germanic gives vanishing cream. Another orphan clue. 14 minutes down. Driver found stuck in middle of dam. What is this? Driver is often L for learner driver or DR. Wow. I think made safe is correct, ochre correct, cream, all of these letters are correct. I'm going to have to come back to six down. Bank 
on Introduction of Ezra Pound, verse... Doggerel. Yeah. Okay, so... How does this work? Doggerel is verse. Ezra is not EZ. Bank is Dogger Bank, which is a location off the coast of England used in weather forecasts for sailors. So Dogger on introduction of Ezra is just the introductory letter of Ezra, which is E. Pound is L, which is Latin for Libra, which is used for, for pound, as in currency. So, oh, E, not massively helpful. However, look at this, there's a V in one down. British brothers who sang about high rise. Ah, this must be Beverly Hills. It fits the letter pattern, and it's a suburb. How does the word play work? So, the British brothers who sang are the Beverly brothers, the Beverly brothers, about high rise, about hill. So, British brothers who sang are the Beverlys, a bit of a stretch, but I think it's okay. About high rise, well, a hill is a high rise, and Beverly Hills is a suburb. So, 16 minutes down, making progress and some useful letters with the B and the Y. Rhythmic jazz lead accepts honour in retirement. No. Knocking back Carol, this goes on forever, this clue. I'm not going to read it all out again. Hector sent back to carry a plant. I think this is Yarra. So to Hector is to Harry, sent back, reversed, to carry a, to include a, and then Yarra, I think, is a plant. No, I think it's Yarrow, which is definitely a plant, and Hector is worry, reversed, and including a. Phew. 17 across. Provocative glimpse of the pub by the sound of it. So pub, I think, is in. By the sound of it refers to a word being spelt differently to how it sounds. And I was thinking in might be using the N from infringe, but it could begin in. Provocative. I wonder if this is inciting. If something's, if something's inciting, it could be provocative. Glimpse of the pub could be an inciting, S-I-G-H-T, by the sound of it, spelt with a C. Okay, I think that's right. Shakes round top. Okay, round is O, top is lid. Shakes is rocks with a K, not being this, yeah, if something's not, not rock solid, it could shake. So, just the top left to go, 18 minutes down. What haven't I looked at? Boring name, boring idol. This is banal. So, banal is boring. Name is N, the abbreviation. Boring, or in the middle of idol, in the middle of Baal, which is a false idol from biblical times. Great, a second B. Rhythmic jazz, I think, is bebop. Lead is PB, the chemical symbol. Accepts honour, accepts OBE in retirement. So reverse, put OBE in PB and reverse it and you get bebop. Move stealthily around rogue US spy base. I'm thinking rogue is an anagram indicator for US spy. Or it could be an anagram indicator for US spy base. That's got nine letters, 
including P, S, ah, no T. 10 across. What could this be? What could the definition be? Knocking back looks like... Looks like part of the word play. But this doesn't look like legs of runners. There will be... A vowel in second place. Knocking back. Castle. Oh, I think this is a hidden clue. I think the restricts indicate is a hidden indicator and the whole answer is staring us in the face. But in reverse, as indicated by knocking back. Let's see if that works. Where is R? There it is at the beginning of real, real, really. So reading backwards from there, you get relay race. Fantastic. It does happen surprisingly often that the hidden clue is one of the last ones one gets, even though in some ways it's the easiest type of clue to get. And this just shows how well disguised this hidden clue was. 21 minutes down. So knocking back indicates reverse, restricts indicates that the answer is hidden within the words you've reversed. And then Legs of runners. Yeah. If you have a relay race, then each of the runners does a leg. OK, so one clue left. This, yes, this is pussyfoot, surely. Surely, surely. To pussyfoot is to move stealthily around. Rogue US spy is an anag anagram of pussy. And then base is foot. The foot of a column is the base of a column. Oh, no, I've just seen that six down hasn't been, hasn't been solved. 22 minutes down. Driver found stuck in middle of dam. Oh, yes. Wow, this is hard. This is hard. So... The dam is a reservoir, reservoir, and in the middle of reservoir, you have servo, and a servo is a component part of an engine, which helps drive the vehicle. So a servo is a driver. Wow, that was that was tough, even with three crossing letters. So there we go. Every clue. Solved. Every clue explained. No empty squares. Submit. Submit. Hope and pray. No errors. Fantastic. Wow, what a beautiful puzzle. Now, before I go any further, let me deal with the announcement that I mentioned at the beginning of this video. So I run a Patreon site for supporters of the channel and there's a link immediately below the video, and I have now started to upload crosswording content to Patreon. So this month I've uploaded three videos. Two of them are of the Times Quick Cryptic, which is intended to be a less challenging puzzle than the main cryptic, and very useful if you're, if you're struggling to solve the main cryptic. So there are two of those, plus, there is also a solve of the Mephisto crossword. Now, the Times is the hardest daily cryptic crossword published in the world, but it is not the hardest cryptic puzzle. And certainly there's a weekly puzzle called the Mephisto puzzle, which is also published in the Times, which has, which is harder than the Times. And it's probably the next stage up. Above the Times, you've got the Mephisto, then you've got the AZ, then you've got the listener. That's the rough, the rough hierarchy. And the Mephisto is very similar to the Times in terms of it being a plain cryptic crossword. And the reason it's harder is that it uses more obscure vocabulary. So quite often you're solving a word and you're relying more on the word play. And you might recognize the, the word that is the solution, but you may not be 100% sure of the definition. So you're placing greater reliance on the word play. But it's super fun and it's still doable without using any aids, as I demonstrate 
in the video. So do check that out if you're interested in additional crosswording content. And there's a ton of Scrabble videos up there as well. And you can join for as little as $2 a month and drop out at any time if you feel so inclined. So thank you very much for your support. If you're already a patron and welcome to those who are contemplating joining. Now back to this puzzle. What a puzzle. I that I felt was jolly hard. It took me a while to get going. I had a, a minor speed up and then rapidly slowed down again and was quite grateful to limp over the finishing line after 23 minutes with a couple of really tricky clues to finish with, including the hidden clue, which was superbly well hidden, relay race and servo, which I think I could have spent a lot longer on if I hadn't spotted that Reservoir was damn at quite an early stage. So absolutely super fun. In terms of the snitch, I would say that this might possibly be approaching 100 or slightly more than 100, but super fun nonetheless and absolutely fantastic entertainment from the times. So I hope you enjoyed watching that solve. Like, comment and subscribe and I will see you next time.